You close your eyes. Make up your mind you're going to stay right here. This is called having right resolve. You're not going to get involved in thoughts of sensuality, thoughts of ill will, thoughts of trying to harm anybody. All you want are good thoughts. Of course, you could spend your whole day thinking good thoughts and nothing much would come of it, but you can try to bring your mind to concentration. That's the best kind of resolve there is. The mind gets to rest and gets to see things more clearly. Because when the mind is still, you can see even slight movements, just like standing still. You can see a lot of things that you can't see when you're running around. You might think that you see more things by running around, but all you see is lots of blurs. But when you stand still, even though you may be looking only at one thing, you can see all the details and get to know it really well. And this is especially important in our mind. Go running around through life, you get to know your own mind in a blur, everybody else's mind in a blur. But if you sit really still, you get to know your one mind very clearly. Clearly, When you know your mind, you can extrapolate that from that to realize, well, this is what other people are going through too, because we're all creating suffering for ourselves. And the thing we want to understand is how we're doing it, why, we, why we're doing it, and how we can stop. And that's the th sort of thing you can see only when you look very carefully at your own mind. So try to get the mind with the breath, and to stay with the breath all the way in, all the way out. So when the mind makes a move, you're there. You can see it. You begin to realize, oh, these are the kinds of moves that take the mind in a bad direction. These are the kinds of moves that take it in a good direction that we can sort things out a lot more clearly. But the first step is to get the mind to stay here. Any thoughts that are going to pull you away right now, you don't have to get involved. Just thoughts about the breath. Think about the breath coming in, think of it going out, think of it being comfortable. Think of that sense of comfort spreading throughout the body. So you can stay right here really steadily and with a sense of well-being. If there's no sense of well-being, it's hard to stay. So see what you can do with your breath to make the body feel more comfortable right now. So the mind can settle in, and then you can observe yourself. Observe what's going on in the body, observe what's going on in the mind. At the very least, learn to know this one mind really clearly. Because it's this, this one mind that's causing all the trouble in your life. You may think that other people are causing trouble, but that's nothing compared with the trouble you're causing yourself. So get to know this one mind and really understand it inside and out. That way you can come to the end of your problems. Because if the mind isn't creating problems for itself, then no matter what else anybody else does, it's not going to weigh down the mind. You yourself are weighing your own mind down. And so this is the mind you want to understand. <laughs>